Hello and welcome. Today I'm going to show you how you make your own auto melee weapon. First you download my mod, save it, and put it in a folder. Then you unzip it. You follow until folder. Okay, now you got the folder. So what you do now is you go to the Grand Theft Auto location, you press mods, update, x 64 DLC, and you have got your folder here. The problem is we need to change folder to our own name. So I'm going to try the Viking Battle Axe. So I'm downloading it. I'm saving it. I will keep it here for now because we need the, uh, the weapon files when we are done. Okay, close this. Okay, so we rename it to Viking and we copy it. Control C or right click and copy. Now we got the Viking with the DLC. We put it in the in the folder of GTA. And we are seeing the Viking is here. So just keep this down and open this one and remove the DLC. It's not from the GTA location but we need the folder, so right click, delete, open, open, peer, go to Windows, Grand Theft Auto, now it's start up, go to mod, update, x64, dlc, and search your, your name, you can change clicking to your own name, double click it, open the dlc, and take all these files, to a folder. Okay, so our name is Viking. Viking. So you start, you know, from the bottom. Set up to right click and then edit with Note plus plus plus. You see, there are in every files you know, some folder. Uh, folder. So what we do is Control F. We search folders. We search the words. How many? Three. We go to change them, and then folder we change to Viking or your own name, and then change all. And as you see, DLC Viking, Viking, it changed all the folders in this. So we save it, we close it, and we open the next one. Edit with no plus plus plus. Control F. We search the now there are 34, 40, I don't know, and then we change them all. I press always two times, three times, just to check, and you can see they all changed. Then we save it again, close it. Just don't don't do anything yet with the X64. We go to Common, Data, and I always start with I. Right click, Control F, Count, change all, save it close, next one, edit, control F, search, change all, and now we have to be careful, okay, we close this, and if you see, it's called weapon folder, because it's, the folder is the name of the weapon we played, and change the name, to the name we use in every, every file, so, Viking, so it's now weapon Viking, or weapon, you know, your name, Right click, edit with notepad, control uh, F, and then we count 11, change all, save. Okay, we have done this tree, so what I always do is wait, and then don't do anything with the anim, or how you say it, just go to content to looks, and you see this is just one, so I double click it, I change the folder to my name. Viking save. DLT's text is nothing. You don't have to do anything but keep it, you know. Okay, right click the multiplayer stat setup, edit with notepad, control F, count 10. So we change them all, we say, oh, we save them. Next one is nothing. We don't have to do the multiplayer stat setup, the second one. 
we go to pet personality edit with notepad control f count the words change them change all save close pickups right click and you do this for for every file so share file change all save shop weapons edit with notepad Controls F, count the words, change them. See, and they all change. Save them. And the last one for this one, edit, control F, folder. So we change them all. As you see, this this is an uh, my fault. It's from the old one that I changed. So why not change it to Viking? So. So because it's your mod, just change it to your own name if you want. So we done this, and we have now this. So press edit mode on open fear, and just only the the files, not the folders. Make sure they have changed. I always press something. Okay, now press the I, and do the same. But wait, you see weapons folder in open fear. Remove this because it. It will change with the Viking, but it will not override because it's a different name. So go, so you made it. Now go back, back, back. Okay. But content and setup. I don't know if we did this, but it changed. Okay, now we go to X64, models, CD image, weapons. You see here in the folder we got a weapon.rpf, just delete this one and make sure you keep the open in the open field. Now go to your, your downloaded weapon, I just downloaded this, so, and as you see, these are the files, I, I will copy, copy, copy them all, and I will go, and just, del uh, let me paste them. And here are the three files. Like we said, we're gonna name it Viking. So we change the name. We uh, lower thing, me lower thing, and then Viking. Dot GDR. Change the second one. Viking. Change the third one. Viking. So you have the three files and you put them in open fear. Okay, so we now we go back, we go back, and now your whole mod is this. We are almost done. The last thing we, sh we need to do, go to update, mod update, update.rpf, common data, and search for DLC list. Put it out, uh, edit it, and you see all these files. Just be these are these are mine, but you see here is the folder. But you don't have to use the folder. You can ch take any one if you want. Just so just take a random um, copy, then go to here and press enter and then spacebar, and then control V. Oh, I was one too far. And now you remove the 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 name between the the things, and you name it your your name that you called your mod. I call it Viking. And then you save it. Make sure edit mode is still on. Replace it. And check if it's there. It's here. So what we do now. We're gonna open the game. So you go to Steam. Grand Theft Auto. Play. Now wait until the game is uh, load up. Oh yeah, this happens sometimes.
maybe because I'm recording my desktop and the game. You can, because you watch this, you can skip this of course until, you know, the story mode has been loaded. <laughs> but I have to watch this all. So let's wait. So we are now in game. Remove all the weapons from my hand. Uh, of course, it's dark outside. Let's open the trailer and then change the time to noon. Change the weather then. Okay, extra soon. Why is it dark when it's noon? Afternoon. Wow, it's not even changing. Okay, wait. I think because of menu. Let's change the time. Ah, okay, that's why. Okay, so it's day. What we do now is we use simple trainer, or I don't know if it can do with menu, but we go to weapons. Then go down, spawn weapon by mobile name. And you type the weapon, uh, and then the low bar, and then your name, Viking, or your the name you changed. And there's your weapon. And now you can use it. You can meet people. I hope you enjoyed the video and if you use my mod please give credits. Thanks, monkey out. <laughs>